How is it going guys? Slippy Jim here. Welcome back to my playthrough of 7 Days to Die. It is the evening of day 28. So we are going to be getting out of our base. Let me just check my armor. And we have chest armor. Oh, I think we're okay with armor. I'm crafting up a bunch of shotgun shells while we walk. But let's just close that. And uh, we're going to be heading out to that really steep hill um, over to the north of the town. And uh, that is where we're going to be setting up to fight the seven day horde. So I'm going to be putting down spikes. I've got 125 of them, so hopefully that's enough. In terms of ammo, uh, I should have, I think, how many we got left there? That's it, 145. So I'm just going to repair this as well. So yeah, 145 shotgun shells. It's uh, It sounds like a lot. Maybe, but it's actually not that many, considering uh, how many zombies we're going to be getting. But um, let's just head over to the edge of town here. So, yeah, usually the horde kicks in around 10 p.m. So I don't know, I don't know how far we're going to get because time goes by very quickly in game here. Back off, dog. Um, we'll see how we go anyway. We'll see how we go. We might get pretty close to it, because wherever you are when 10 o'clock hits is basically where the horde zeroes in on, so that's where you kind of have to hang out. But, um, getting a bit low on stamina, we might have to... Oh, here we go. This is what I want right here. This is that really steep road. So we should actually be okay with setting, setting up here. Um, I kind of wanted to set up some torches and stuff. We'll see how we go with that. Let's just drink this because otherwise I'm going to be moving at a snail's pace here. So the theory is that the zombies are not going to be, can't be able to walk up the sides because it's too steep. So they're going to have to come, um, they're going to have to come from the top or the bottom, depending which direction they come from. We might be almost safe up here because they'll just be like beating on the um, the side of the cliff the whole time, which would be pretty funny. Um, let's just put some torches here. I don't know how much. I have to stay away from the cars because they blow up. Try to set these up here. So we got a little bit of light. So we can sort of stay away from the edge. It'd be pretty tragic if I fell off the edge myself and died that way. I have to be kind of careful of that, because it's exactly the kind of thing that I would do. Okay, and one more up here. Now we have to put the spikes down, so let's do that. Leave some gaps. So, I mean, the exploding cars could be a problem, but um, at the same time, they might actually... Okay, here we go. It's on now. They might actually take out some zombies for me as well. I get lucky. Okay. Here's our first. They're coming from down below there. That's what's happening. <gasps> oh, God. Oh, God. I didn't reload. That's a rookie mistake. Well, I've got to be careful here. This is pretty hazardous. Going down here is alright. Where are they? Okay, she's. I think she's dead. I'm not sure where the zombies are. Just put some more of these down. Okay, I can hear them coming. I can hear them coming. We got a... We got a feral. Oh, God. The heal is actually... Actually really slows you down. Try and get to the top and then... Oh, it is... It's a blood moon. Look at that. We didn't have a blood moon before. Let's go back down. Going down is going to be way faster. 
If I can make them run uphill, that might be the way to do it. But so far we haven't got too many zombies. I think they're stuck. I think they oh god. I think they're stuck at the bottom of the hill. Yeah, let's go back up. Oh, oh man. Okay, I'm drinking my beer. I'm drinking my beer. Let's get back up top. I probably don't have enough spikes. Oh man. See that's the uh, that's the winded effect right there that slows the zombies down. It's pretty cool. Okay, they're coming from up top there now. I need to stick a few more of these down. Oh, that was that was right on top of the, the car there. Okay, let's keep going. Hey buddy! Why is he moving so slow? He must be super winded. Keep going, keep going. So far, so good. I'm not overheating or anything, which is good. Got a couple of zombies down here. It's very, very dark. It's hard to see. Okay. I think that's the bottom of the hill right there. Whoa, dude. <laughs> I don't know what his turning stuff is like. I don't know if I'm still deciding if this was a good strategy or not up here. It's, we're not getting that many zombies. Man, he takes a lot of damage. I think my club actually does more damage than the shotgun at the moment because it's ranked up way more. Okay, let's go back downhill a little bit. Yeah, there's only a couple of zombies. I think most of them are stuck down the bottom of the hill. So if we can keep them down there until, um... Oh, what the heck? Is that a bear? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, no. It's a bear. We got a zombie bear. I got it. I gotta slow him down if I can. Keep going. We can do this. Hopefully the bear's gonna kill some zombies for me. Oh man. Shotgun skills leveling up here. Alright. I don't know where that bear is. It kinda has me worried. I'm gonna need another beer. Let's, um, let's drink this, get some stamina back. Wow, it is so dark down here. Something's going on over there. I can hear, I can hear some zombies down there. They might be beating on the cliff. Oh man. Oh man. Gotta, gotta conserve my ammunition a little bit. The bear's still down there somewhere. Okay, we gotta head back down. Try to keep them walking back over the spikes as much as I can. It's the plan. Man, it is so dark back here. I do have some spikes. Can't see very much. Man, that's just too dark. What happened to my... Oh! Keep going! Keep going! Can hear a spider zombie over there. Come to think of it, there haven't been any dogs yet. I wonder where the dogs are at. Oh man, I'm gonna run into the spikes myself here in a second. Well, let's 
try and place some more spikes up here. Stop banging on my spikes! <gasps> oh, I nearly went off the side. <laughs> that was crazy. Where are they? So it's like 2 a.m. right now. We've got four hours to go until we can semi-relax. <gasps> oh no, 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 no. First aid kit. I'm having another beer even though I don't need it. <laughs> that nurse is like crazy, man. She's like, she's like worse than the ferals. Well, she's crawling now, so... Oh no. Gotta watch, watch out that I don't start bleeding and then just bleed to death without noticing. That would be unfortunate. Let's put some more spikes down this end. Well, it's pretty quiet, actually. Probably because that they're all stuck at the bottom of the cliff. I think that is, uh... That's what's going on. <laughs> oh! Sidestep for the win! I still haven't killed one of these guys, I don't think. Maybe the spikes have. There's a crawler right there. I actually want to keep the ferals alive until um, 6 a.m. so I can try and loot them. Put some spikes down here as well. None of the cars have blown up so far. Alright, I could just chill at the top of the hill here. <laughs> Let's repair this. I wish it put it back in the in the right slot after after it was repaired. They must be all falling off the side now or something. Because I don't see any. Mind you, they they would have spawned in down the bottom of the hill, so that's probably where they're um That's probably where they are right now. <clears throat> Affected survivor. Try and loot these guys. Girl Walker. He had a crappy magnum part on him. Usually they have awesome loot, but what are you doing there, buddy? should use my club on him, he's like super slow for some reason. My club does way more damage. Oh god. There's a crawler over there, I have to watch out for him. <laughs> Level 14 blunt weapons. Oh! 4 a.m. Okay, they're probably going to start sprinting on me in a second. Let's give them another blast of this. Die! They kind of look a little bit like the Terminator or something. Pretty creepy looking. Oh! Look out! Look out! Uh, not taking any chances here. Alright. Let's get back to the club. Why is he moving so slow? <gasps> oh. Try and shoot him in the top of the head, that's the most vulnerable spot. Oh, 
there we go. Good night. Okay, and there's this other guy over here. How many rounds have I got left? Let's use the club. It's kind of hard to hit. This is so low. Ouch. Looks like he's swimming in the tarmac. Like his head pops up every now and then. Okay, I'm just going to take one of these. And I'll eat one of these. Ooh, okay. Some of that stuff's pretty good, actually. Let's just scrap the crappy one. Alright! Well, this was an awesome spot, guys. This was an amazing spot. I'm definitely going to use this again if I have to, but... Hopefully by the next Day 7 Horde, we'll have all the materials that we need. I can hear them down there banging on stuff. <clears throat> but hopefully we'll have all the materials that we need, need to, um, to fortify the base rather than, rather than um, having to do this. I way prefer like uh, defending a base against a Horde rather than just running around like a headless chicken. But sometimes you got to do what you got to do. Like this current current version of uh, Seven Days Alpha 14. It's it takes a long time to set up where you can um, where you can build and uh, and upgrade the blocks and get concrete reinforced uh, concrete going and stuff like that. I'm kind of curious as to where all the zombies are. Probably just down here. Well, it's 6 a.m. now. Let's go have a look. So it looks like we're gonna survive another Day Seven Horde. All right, let's see. Where are these guys? I haven't seen any. Well, were there any dogs? I don't think there were. So, so what are these guys doing down here? A couple of cops. Try and take this guy out. Okay, there's there's a dog right there. I really want to get to the point where I can one-shot a dog with a shotgun. That would be awesome. Ouch. Oh, so good. Okay, we got a lot of cops. Ouch. Dudes. From eating all those, from eating all those sham sandwiches. Oh, it's a lot of cops down here. Kind of want to take this one out. Pick that up. Oh man. Trouble is my crossbow right now is more powerful than the shotgun. I haven't got that many bolts left. We're keeping out for the dogs. She dead? Oh man! This th this guy is stuck in the crossfire all that vomit. Let's just loot everything. Look out! Oh god, oh god, so much, so much vomit. Let's try and buzz them so they blow up.
Oh, run, he's gonna blow up. He's gonna blow up. There he goes. What about you? You gonna blow up? Oh. Oh, God. Okay, I'm playing with fire now. Let's <laughs> let's head back to base. I'm just gonna take some pain painkillers, maybe. I don't know why I picked up that dog food. It's kind of looting everything, I guess. Let's chuck some. Okay, actually, I'll keep that. Oh, that's tuna. Uh, drink that. Okay, well, day 29, guys. We have survived. So, I think what we're going to do um, today is I'm going to be mining. I'm just going to do basically mining and that and getting resources and stuff like that. So, um, don't be surprised if the next episode it's day 30, the morning of day 30, because it's going to be super boring to watch me like just digging for stuff. <laughs> Continually, but I do need like a whole ton of stone. I need a whole ton of of um, uh, What else do I need? Uh, just basically stuff for fortifying and fortifying and stuff like that um, While I'm out here, I'm just gonna get some some more water Yeah, I think it was uh, mainly stone the heck was that that was very weird noise Mainly stone that I need um, to make the cobblestone, and I also need sand for the cement. Um, and I think we need a lot of iron as well. That's more like it. So yeah, that is the plan, basically, and uh, we might leave this episode here for today. I hope you have enjoyed this pretty crazy seven-day horde here on day 28. Well, it's now day 29. I'll see you guys in the next episode where we're going to hopefully be reinforcing the base a lot more and um, and uh, hopefully get it pretty much um, reinforced, concreted up, maybe some iron bars and some stuff like that so we can um, defend the base next time. So I'll leave it there, guys. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Slippy Jim out.